this reality show has got to work. All right, Jeff, what do you got for me? And it better not be another reality show. I hate those things. Uh, mind if I go to the bathroom real quick? All right, make it quick. Okay. Oh, crap. What am I gonna do? All right, let's think of something new, think of something new. Um, what do people like? There's, there's mystery. Cop drama, yeah. No, that's... It's used too much. What kind of me? Let's see, something live, something new. I've got it. It's called Urban Legends Debunked. It's like Mythbusters, but with urban legends. The host will test the different legends to see if they're true. I don't know, Jeff. I'm still trying to get some of my money for that last year. Oh, come on, it wasn't that bad. Alright, I'll back you on this one. But you better make me some money, right? No problem, Mr. Roman. Whatever it takes. Next. Hello. Oh, hi, uh, your name is? Um, it's Jordan. Okay, uh, why do you want to be part of Urban Legends? Uh, well, I, um, you see it. Uh, next. Hi, uh, your name is? I'm Alex, I'm from Eastern Michigan, but I'm actually not from Michigan. I'm from Alaska, and it's really cold, but I mean, have you ever seen those husky okay. dogs? Okay, okay, great, next. <laughs> Howdy. Oh, hi, Jeff Hewitt. Jim Without Jones, that's your service. Okay, well, Mr. Jones, uh, what brings you here today? Let me make a start in television. Oh, really? Do you, uh, do you have any experience? Yes, I directed and starred in numerous plays back in Alabama. Oh, really? Great. Um, so where do you think your talents would best be used here? In front of the camera. Oh, okay. And you said you're from Alabama, you say? Yes, sir. All right, great. Uh, well, you know what? We'll be in contact, so I'll see you later. And the next person. Have a nice day. You too. What's up, bro? Hi, your name? Corey Kevin. Alright, Corey, why Urban Legends? Because I believe in revealing all the truths and unanswered questions. Really? No, I just want to be on TV. Okay, um, so what position are you trying for? Host, the Shocker. And why do you feel that you should get this position? Well, because I'm like all the other people that are going to be watching this show, so... Okay, alright, um, we'll be in contact. Send the next person there. Uh, there's nobody else. Wait, what? That was the last one. Oh dear. Bye. Well, congratulations. Uh, being here means that you guys are now going to be part of Urban Legends Debunk. Does that mean I'm the host? Well, no, but you will be on camera. So who will be? You. Yes. Jebediah will be your assistant, and Linda will be the director of photography. Um, quick question. When are we doing the interviews? What interviews? You know where we talk to famous historians who unearth these urban legends? Ah, well, actually, it's not that kind of show. We're going to test the uh, urban legends ourselves. Really? So, so when are the uh, rehearsals? Uh, actually, it's going to start Monday, 8 a.m. sharp. 8 a.m.? Yes, 8 a.m. All right. I'll be seeing ya. Okay, I guess that means the meeting's over. Hey, Jeff? Yeah, uh, what's up? So, what will I be doing, exactly? Well, as, uh, director of photography, uh, you'll be setting up and filming the shots. What? Like a cameraman? It's more than that, but, yeah. You know I'm from corporate, right? Yeah, yeah, I do, and that, that's why I put you there, because I need to be able to trust you. Yeah. To point a camera. I know I shouldn't have to do this job. I'll see you on Monday. Okay. 
Where's Corey? I don't know. He was supposed to be here 15 minutes ago. That's why y'all should have made me the host of this shindig. I knew it wouldn't be a good host. Hey! Alright, you shouldn't be talking about him like that. Even if it's true. Finally! Where were you? You know, I had, uh, better things to do. So he slept in. It's great. Corey, we were fixed on firing you, man. Hey! Alright, we're not firing anybody, alright? Let's just get shooting. Yes, Besides, um. Besides, I'm getting a headache. Okay, Urban Legends, take one. And action! Corey Kevin here. And Jebediah Gems. And today we'll be filming Urban Legends on. Urban Legends Debunked. Yeah, no! Yeah, that just gives my boots are shaking. Anyways. We'll be testing... What is it again? Cut! Are you serious? We went over this a million times. So maybe if you would have uh, showed up on time, you would have knew it was Bloody Murray. Take two. Action. So we'll be testing out Bloody Mary. You know what we used to call it down south? No. Susie Slaughter. Thanks for wasting five seconds of my life. Anyways, let's see this bad boy rolling. Girl. What? Bloody Mary's a girl? Cut! Linda, just cut out Jeb's stupid comments. Do not tell me what to do, Sleeping Beauty. Take three. Action. So we'll be testing out Bloody Mary. One, two, three. Bloody Mary. Bloody Mary. Bloody Mary. See, nothing happened. Ah! Oh, sweet Jesus. Saw a mouse. Wow, really? Cut! Okay, next shot. Take one. Action. So we just learned the first legend was false. Now I'm on to legend number two. Which is, you know, the one with the ghost pushing the car. Oh yeah, I knew that. That's right. So, uh, anyways, uh... Cut! Ah, <sighs> alright, you know what guys? I'm gonna be, uh, I'm gonna be totally honest. Totally honest. It's horrible, okay? Just, Linda, just go up and do the next shot, okay? Fine. Let's go, ma'am. Which road is it again? Don't ask me. I'm just a pretty face. Will you two just shut up? It's the next right. We got it ripped off. Action. What's up, guys? We're about to test legend number two. And it says if we're on this road alone at night and the cars are neutral, the ghost will push us along. Ready? Did you feel the car move? No, Corey. The car hasn't moved an inch. Looks like this one's also false. Think of this yourself. Cut! Ugh! Jeff is gonna hate this. Just go back to the studio. Yes, I'm... Hello? Hey, Jeff. It's Brian. Oh, hey, Mr. Ullman. Listen, Jeff, I got some bad news. What? I'm pulling the plug on Urban Legends. Wait, why? I don't think it would be a good investment for the company. Well, we already did rehearsals. You can't do this to me. Jeff, you cost the company an enormous amount of money. How do I not have the right to do this? Just give me one more shot. All right, this is the last straw, Jeff. If this isn't good, you can say bye-bye to your job. But Mr. Oldman... <sighs> this is never going to sell well. Hopefully the shoot will go better. Well, I mean, they know it's a pilot, right? Ah, oh, who am I kidding? It's gotta be good. This is unacceptable! Hey, somebody wake up on the wrong side of the bed? Focus on your acting! You had enough there to worry about. What happened? The CEO is trying to stop the show. He can't do that! He sure can, and he will unless we do something about it. Any ideas? <sighs> well, I was thinking of something like in the local area. Like what? Well, I got a letter the other day from a school in Metro Detroit. They wanted us to test one of their legends. <sighs> I think that would work. You know what? I think that could be our gimmick. We can go and test the other legends. I don't know. Well, I like it. 
All right, you know what? We'll shoot tomorrow. Start right away. I can't. I got a date. Be there or you're fired! Hey, Linda, relax. All right, you're going to have to cancel, Corey. I can't deal with him right now. I need to leave. All right, 8 a.m. Sharp. We're starting. So what are we doing here again? Okay, I want you to intro the show. This auditorium's right here. Intro the show. Talk about it, because the auditorium is where most of the action happens. Linda, I want to make sure that all the shots are clear and the angle's all right. Okay? Okay. All right. Come on, Corey. Action. Alright guys, we're back and we're ready to test the legend of the JG Auditorium. The legend has that if you turn off all the lights in the auditorium, count 10 seconds, the suit ghost will appear. Alright Alex, turn off the lights in 3, 2, 1. Well, Jeff, I saw your last episode. You did? Yes, I did. Oh. And it was great! What? Your idea to change the plot into a fictional TV show about a real TV show was great. When do you start filming for next episode? Uh... Well, it better be soon, because I've already got offers for this. Oh, okay. I'll schedule it soon. Alright. Tell me when, because I want to see you getting shot. So you ready to start filming those new episodes? What do you mean new episodes? You have to keep filming. Olbin loved it. I have to do this my last shot. No, I'm not filming any more of these legends. You have to, Corey. This could be the start of your career, even. Wait. Does he know what really happened? What he doesn't know won't hurt him. No, we have to find out who did this. Oh, I know who did it. Do as I say and nothing bad will happen. How could you do that to them? It's a dog-eat-dog -dog world out there. Ones who take action will reap the benefits. Just host the show and nothing bad will happen to you. So, what about Linda? Oh, let's just say we have a new director of photography. She knew too much. <laughs> oh, and Corey, you better watch your back. You never know what will happen in a matter of seconds. 